Hi there everybody and welcome to another video. On today's video I have this uh, VW Passat. This is a 2006, the B6 model. Um, I'm just going to show you how to access your indicator bulb, the one that's sitting. So this is your headlight here and I have the indicator bulb right here. Um, it's just that I have the car on the ramp and it might be a little bit easier to show you how you can access that bulb and basically um, there is a screw that's sitting in here it's a Phillips screw it's a little bit difficult to see but it's, it is in there um, and you need to basically undo that Phillips screw now the easiest way to really to get to the screw and to get it out is to remove this cover as well which also has a Phillips screw. Okay, so once you remove your little Phillips screw from here, you wanna pull this cover towards you. Um, at the same time, you wanna try and get a flathead screwdriver in between here, just in, in the gap in here, because there is a, a like a clip in there. If you pull it and force this out without doing that, it, it might break the clip. So I kind of already remove it so I can show you um, because I'm just got one hand here, so it'll be a bit difficult, but that's the little bit that is like a clip. This other one is, is almost like a guide pin. It doesn't really have a clip. Um, and down here, you also have those two like guides and this one here and you have another bit there as well so that basically comes out like that it's not really hard but just a little bit fiddly and uh and trying not to break anything you then have much better access to the Phillips screw in here. Which might be a little bit tight if it hasn't been out in a while. You could potentially replace this cluster here as well if it was damaged or broken or anything like that because uh, technically you could access the bulb from uh, I'll show you in a minute so let's get this screw out here right Come out there, let's get this light out and here is your indicator bulb but if this was sitting in there you could potentially get your hand from this end and try to get the um, indicator out but it's a bit of a fiddle so it's easier to get that out and then you can twist this like so anti-clockwise and remove that bit there and that's where the bulb is i don't really have to change this bulb but uh just for the purpose of the video if you push this in so push it in and twist it, it will come out, just like a light bulb. It's got two clips at the bottom, they're offset. And this bulb, it's got a number there which is difficult to see. <laughs> so I'll try to search for it. And
I think it's a Philips 12 volts, 21 watts. But we'll try to see what is a H21W, I think. Well, I'll have to, I'll research it and then try to um, see what type of bulb this is. And then you can just uh, push that in your new bulb. It can only fit in the position of the two pins. Push it down a bit and twist it and it locks into place. And again, push it, you push it back in there and again, twist it. So that goes in there. twists and locks into position and you can refit this back and that's it one screw there then you cover back here one screw so hope this video helps don't forget to subscribe we'll see you on the next video thank you for watching